the Sensex is at this point trading at 18,416, up by 22 uh, points. And the Nifty is trading at 5,530, up by 3 point, uh, uh, 4 points. Looks, it's still a little flattish at this point of time. Well, let's take some more callers. We have Mr. Balaji from Nanganalur. Good afternoon, sir. Tell us uh, what is your query. Uh, next about last month to grow in the long term, next uh, one year. Okay. And uh, what price did you buy it in? Uh, 600. 600. Okay, yeah. so he's bought it in 600 and wants to wait up for a year. What kind of advice? Can That's a company. Uh, really uh, has got a lot of potential uh, for the future. I'm really happy that all our callers are talking about to blue chips. Their concentration is on good companies, quality companies. That way, Larson T. Bro, currently, if you look at uh, trading around 1700, um, I suggest people to keep on buying this company in general because uh, anytime it can announce the demerger. So, about nine companies okay. are going to come out from this LNT. Okay. So, the value unlocking might take place anytime. Even retailers, I suggest even buy one share and keep it. Don't sell okay. it off. Wait for the demerger. So, for this viewer also, we can say keep okay. buying this company. You bought it lower price, then enjoy the price raise what you are uh, having it now. Don't sell it hurriedly. Wait for a cool period to enjoy the full benefit of the company. So, uh, there, sir, if you want to enjoy the full uh, reaps of this uh, stock, you have to wait on. LNT is going to give you a good uh, profit. Now, we have another caller calling us all the way from Bangalore. He is uh, Mr. Anand. Good afternoon, sir. What is your query? Yeah, good afternoon. Hello. Yes, sir. Go yeah, ahead with I your query. Go ahead. Pardon me? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, very good afternoon. I'm calling from Bangalore, of course. Yes. I just want to know, uh, I, uh, I, in fact, I bought shares uh, from Avon of uh, Avon of course. Uh, Avon, Avon, A, Avon of okay. course. Okay. Uh, about a few months back. Okay. Uh, it was, in fact, about uh, 890 uh, when I brought. Okay. And now it is 5, 6 plus something. Okay. Uh, so it's not appreciating for the past two, three months. Okay. So, like, uh, anyhow, well, if you say, if you say per day, intraday, it is, of course, always appreciating 10 point, uh, plus 10 or plus 5 and so. Okay. So, I would like to know, uh, what is the future of this, uh, you know, uh, share or uh, what is, what will be the, uh, you know, the future of, uh, Okay. What is the clear so, picture he wants of the future? See, as far as Aban is concerned, you know, after they were losing the big rig, there was a good amount of loss for the company. Fundamentally, if you look at uh, from that loss, uh, it started recovering slowly. But currently, it is moving in a sideway, keeping a support at uh, 500. What we can suggest to our viewer, uh, this is a fundamentally strong company, despite uh, the losses it incurred couple of quarters before and uh, it's, uh, no, it's able to now sustain in this business and uh, it is making a side day means it is expecting a rise from the current level. Okay. So, those who waited so long, you know, don't lose your patience, hold on uh, uh, for some more time, but uh, if you want technically look at 500 is a good support, if it breaks it may come down. So, that way hold with a stop loss of 500, moment it breaks say about uh, 700 level, they will see that a uh, very nice movement towards 900 levels. Okay. So there you have it, Mr. Anand. Make sure just right through this point at this phase of the stock uh, at this point of time. And of course, one stop loss at 500 and after it breaks through 700, it will almost go up to 900. So that's the uh, expert's view on the stock. Well, it's now time uh, for the pick of the day where the expert gives us their stock and why they have picked it. So you've uh, chosen Bombay Dying. Tell us, tell the viewers what's uh, so special about the stock today. So, Bombay Dying generally household name in general on the textile industry point of view, but there is other phase for Bombay Dying. There are a lot of land, land bank, you know, there are, wherever they are, the mills, there are a lot of land bank which they are converting into commercial area. Mm -hmm. So, they, we can also look at them as the infra uh, developers. So, from that point of view, now all the infra companies are now uh, turning around. That way, Bombay Dying is one of the uh, one of the leading uh, in that area, Bombay area on uh, commercial development that is going to help them to improve their profitability in the coming quarters. So, we suggest people to buy the stock at the current level because it made a short fall from 390 to 360 levels. So, this is a time to pick up the stock at least some small quantity which will give them a rewarding return in short term as well as long term. Well, so there you have it. Bombay Dying is the pick of the day. 
Well, a quick update on the market now. It slipped into the red. The market is on, uh, and now it's also gone up. It's trading at 18,415 and it's up by 18%. And the Nifty is at uh, hovering around 5,500 levels and it's up by 2%. However, the market is still, uh, Sensex is still on flat, but uh, NTPC, LMT, TCS are one of the top gainers. Well, that's all we have time for in this show of stocks calling. You can always email us, us at uh, feedback at ndtv-hindu.com for all your stock queries and we will take it up with the expert at that point of time. Well, keep watching NDTV Hindu for all the latest news and updates.